What's going on everyone? e Pacmans is back with another Fortnite video and today we look at Season 8 Week 2 Fortnite Challenges. But before we do that, I have two things to get off my chest. First off, I want to apologize for last week's mic issue. I understand it was pretty bad. And so that's not going to happen again. Hopefully this quality right now is a lot better. And then second, I just want to thank everybody for a huge amount of support. Uh, I gained a lot of subscribers through the last video and if you guys did like the Fortnite challenge guide, I will keep doing that for all of Season 8 and maybe even beyond. If you guys want to continue seeing those, just let me know. And then, um, I just actually, I do want to add one more thing. You guys make sure to follow me on social media, um, at epacmans, on Twitter, Instagram, uh, Snapchat, and then I also have another epacmans club Twitter account, so make sure to follow me on there as well. But without further ado, let's get started on Season 8, Week 2. So here up on the screen, as you guys can see, I have it up. So the first challenge is Stage 1 out of 5. We have to land on the block. Okay, that's so easy. So I'm pretty sure all 5 stages are just going to be landing somewhere. Next one we got Deal Damage to Descending Supply Drops. Okay, that's going to be tougher, but that's still easy. Um, third one, we have Eliminations at Salty Springs or Haunted Hills. Okay, so we know a lot of people are going to be there. And then another stage uh, challenge, we have stage one of three, gain health from apples, okay. The hard part's going to be finding apples for that. Um, the next challenge we have, visit the furthest north, south, east, west points of the island. Okay, that, that shouldn't be too bad. Then deal damage to opponents with the pirate cannon. Oh, that's going to be a lot tougher to be honest. Um, just finding somebody lined up <laughs> for the cannon, that's going to be tougher. And it says search a chest in different name locations in a single match. So three chests in different name locations. A little tough, but it won't be too bad. Alright, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, I think for the first challenge, I'm going to go for search chest in three different locations. And I'm going to land here in retail row. There we go, chest number one. Okay. No, I'm not even going to bother getting a weapon. I'm just going to go straight to, um, I'm going to go to Salty. Look, I found an apple. I'm going to take, <laughs> take damage. Ate an apple. There we go. So that's 5 out of 25. Who knew this was going to be easier than I thought? Oh, just need one more apple. There it is. Bingo. Gain 25 health from apples. Check. Awesome. Good thing I had some dynamite on me. Okay, we made it to Salty Springs. Let's hope there is a chest for me somewhere. Come on, let me get to it. Perfect. Okay. That's two locations. Okay, so I just gotta hope. I'm, I'm here in Lucky Landing. I just gotta hope there's a chest to search. That'll be the third one. And perfect, right on cue. Awesome. And I'm actually gonna take this because I'm gonna shoot at a care package right outside. This is also a challenge. I don't even care if I don't get it. I just want to shoot at it. And I even got a kill. Nice. So for this one, I'm going to land at the block, which is stage one of five for one of the challenges. And there we go. Land at the block. Stage 2 of 5. Land at Dusty Divot. Okay, so let's land at Dusty Divot then. All the way over here. Alright, step 2 of 5. Land in Dusty Divot. And here we are. Okay. 
Let me just get down and there we go. Awesome. Okay, stage three of five, land at Polar Peak. Alright, stage 3 of 5, land in Polar Peak, and we are here, let's just give it a land, nice, land at Polar Peak, awesome. Stage 4 of 5, land at Snobby Shores, stage 4 out of 5, land in Snobby Shores, there we go, awesome, we did it guys. Alright guys, stage 5 out of 5, land in Paradise Palms, and we are here, done. Alright, now I'm going to show you the most western part of the map. It's on Snobby Shores. The most western part of the map is over here. Let's go take a look. Most western part, check. Look, there's even a sign over here to let you guys know. Right by Snobby Shores is the most western part. Can't even break it. Alright, now I'm going to show you guys the most eastern part of the map. Showed you western, and that is eastern right there. Let's see. So on the map, it's going to look like all the way at this point right there where I'm circling. Yep, and you can see the sign as I'm getting closer. Yep, oh, we already got it. I didn't even have to land. But just in case if you guys want to see most eastern part, check. So you got western and eastern. Okay, so for this one, we're going to go to the most southern part of the map, which is way over here by Lucky Landing. So you can see my marker. And yeah, you can see the sign right here. Visit the most southern part, check! Okay, now we're gonna visit the most northern part, which is kind of tricky because it's not dead north. Uh, it's like straight in the middle north, but it's right here off a cliff again. Way over there. Okay, we are approaching the most northern part of the map. And again, it's not in dead middle north. It's kind of towards the side, a little towards the west side, but here we are, most northern side, and we finished the challenge. And again, I'll put it up here. That's where it is. And C1, all the way at this peak over here. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to try for the eliminations in Haunted Hills. Uh, I see one guy already, and you need to get three eliminations either, either Salty Springs or Haunted Hills. So let's see if we can get these done. Oh, that guy got me. Okay, so that's one elimination, Haunted Hills. Okay, so I want to go to Salty Springs um, to see if we can get our kills there. I just need two more. Oh, nice. Our circle's in Salty Springs, so we're going to be able to get these kills for sure. One kill, nice. So one more, one more. Okay, one more kill in Salty Springs and I see my victim. No, come on, get closer. I hate these SMGs for long range. Got my third kill, nice. Okay, stage two, gain health from campfires. So I'm gonna carry some dynamite again, or something, and then um, just deal damage to myself so I can gain some health. Just 50. Okay, so let's see if we can find a campfire somewhere so I can recover from it, and then move on to the next challenge. 
I need some dynamite in this. Wow, what are the odds? Oh, I might use a stink bomb. I'm gonna get myself to down to 50. There we go. There we go. So uh, all you have to do is gain 50 health from a campfire. So I'm just gonna stand here, wait till I get to 50. did the trick perfect because campfires only get you up to 50. okay stage three of three gain health using medkits so i have to gain 75 health using medkits that would be not too bad okay we got the stink bombs all we need is the medkit okay we found the medkit so let's give myself 75 health damage so I'm gonna get myself down to 25 or less. All right, that should be good enough. Now all we gotta do is use the med kit and we should complete the challenge. Let's see if it works. Nice. We got it. So all that I have left is damage from a pirate cannon. And that is really, really hard. I'm not going to lie. That's really hard. But I'm going to give it a go. That actually worked! Oh my gosh, I did it! I can't believe that actually worked. He ran right into it. That's crazy. Got it done though. So that's all that matters. Alright, that took forever, but... Now it's time for the secret battle star that is in the volcano, so you can't miss it. Here we go. Battle star. Where are you? Should be around here somewhere. Where the heck is this battle star? Oh, there we go. It wasn't a battle star this time, it was a banner. So it was right here, right by the throne. Right over here. Well, that'll just about do it, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, hopefully, this was better quality than the last video. And I do have to say, when you guys attempt these challenges, the cannon is by far the hardest challenge. It literally took me about, I want to say, an hour and a half to two hours. That is super, super hard. So just stick with it. You guys can do it. Um, even if you have to camp it out, you know, just wait for somebody to pop up right in front of you. Who cares? Do what you got to do. Trust me, it's really, really hard, and I was getting frustrated myself. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Week 2 season eight challenges and if you guys did enjoy it make sure to drop a like again make sure to follow me on social media um, instagram twitter snapchat at epacmans and i also have a epacmans club twitter account so make sure to follow me on there as well to stay updated uh for when i post and then if you don't already turn on that bell 
button notification so you don't miss an upload. Make sure to share it with your friends, family, the rest of the Fortnite community so they can beat week two in a matter of of hours maybe minutes i don't know and once again thank you guys so much stay tuned for more club videos guys peace out okay guys just one last thing just to prove it to you guys that i finished week two um there it is season eight week two 100 percent all done all right i'll see you guys in the next video peace out